trying to find was this smoking gun. One thing that was in here that we could see in there, and we found it, and it's this crane uh, right here. The reason I have trouble with this red dot is I'm right being colorblind, so I have to shine it on something to, to show it. Right there is a crane, and I'm going to show it to you in another photo here. Okay, now this is the building, and uh, this is uh, a close-up. I'm going to show you a, a uh, um, this is this is this is three floors right here, and this is the uh, what I call ramp. Now I call this facetiously a parking garage, uh, but it is definitely a three-story building. Somebody built it for it on the moon. That's a colorized version of it. This I'll show you. This is this is a long ramp, and you can see right here the beautiful arches right there, and the arches go in like that. Let's see if I got a colorized version of it. Here's a colorized version. You can see the arches down there. I sure wish I could see where I could find that dot. Here is a bucket wheel excavator, and it's really interesting because I looked at this thing for years, and I was trying to make it out as a tank, and the vapor was flowing out. But it's not. That is a bucket wheel excavator, and that's dust coming out of the dirt, coming out of the top of the excavator and flowing down the hillside. That's an enlargement, and you can see some of the, uh, the buckets right there. Okay, now these are the two um, uh, vapors indication of vapors there that, uh, that are going up. And of course if you have, if you don't, if, if the moon is a vacuum, you can't have vapor. So this is one of the evidence that there is certainly a, uh, uh, an atmosphere on the moon. This is a photo that uh, Ron put together to show you all the stuffs in that one photo. This is the crane. Right there, and this is it, color, or colorized, right there. This is the left portion of the crater Copernicus. And this thing right here is the bucket of the Lex crater. And here's what's really interesting. This is what we call a keep. It's a road. It goes all the way from here, all the way up there, and there's all kinds of things on that road. There's buildings, I'll show you a bucket wheel excavator, there's cranes, there's all kinds of stuff up there. And up here, there's all kinds of stuff up there. Here we have uh, smoke, there's a building, there's a uh, road graded road bed. Here's all kinds of stuff, all this is on the uh, thing. And uh, this is the wheel, which is this, which is this bucket wheel excavator up there. It's huge. Now, uh, as we're putting this up there, sometimes we get a little feedback from NASA and through guys that post on the, the web. And um, one of them said, yeah, NASA, it found a lot of that ancient stuff, you know, it's been there for, you know, millions of years. And I said, well, if that's the case, then you better tell them that uh, it's still running and they need to turn it on. <laughs> I need to go back here.
the Marius uh, crater. By the way, this is Kepler. Now, let me get that. See all that stuff here? All that's construction. This is a mining camp. You can see all the dust and the stuff coming down there. And this is a, a set, a bunch of buildings right there. I'll see if we can enlarge it for you. And this white slab is part of a cover-up. I don't know what's there, but they obviously painted that part in. Now, you can see there, that's the little city, that's the slab. This is the mining operation. You can see the road, you can see uh, dust coming down, all that, and all this construction over here. Now, this is from Lunar Orbiter, and I forget what the uh, number is. Several years later, the NASA uh, Apollo 15 uh, took a picture to get a clearer picture of all this. That's the clearer picture. Uh, naturally, everything's gone. No mining camp. No city. No part here. No part there. Let me just take it back just to remind you. That was taken by Lunar Orbiter. That was taken by Apollo 15. Now, do you see any airbrush work there? <laughs> Kepler. It's Kepler. Here is a beautiful... Oh, wait a minute. Can't see something. I was going to show you something really neat on the moon, but it appears that NASA's airbrushed it anyway. <laughs> Now here, this next one is really the, oh no. I was gonna show you something really fantastic. <laughs> Damn. Here we're back to the uh, uh, or, uh, Aristarchus. And this is NASA's picture of Aristarchus. Now look at the difference. Now I put them so that they're facing the same from the same general direction. This is the fusion reactor, but you look at NASA's crater and it looks somewhat different. Okay, now I took the time, sit in the dark and look at these photos. And if you get the CD, you can look yourself. But this is what I see in the back. There's definitely curved structures. I don't know where work people live or what it is. Um, this is a hexagonal shaped dome, there's no question about that. Um, and you can see the containment of the radiation. I mean, it's obviously a circle of some kind that's containing it. Uh, this is a flow out of some kind. You can see this obvious rectangular opening down here. You can see an obvious road that goes right there. There's obviously three tunnel openings right there. You can see arches right there. I wonder if there's anybody on the moon. Do you think this is formed naturally? <laughs> you can see containment, it's like a containment pool. But anyway, really interesting things. And the way I do is uh, at night, you know, turn off all the lights and get the computer and my eyes adjust and then turn it on and then, and then look at it. It takes a while. It's not something that you can switch from uh, looking uh, at um, the can cleans or something like that and then turn this on and look at it. You have to get your eye, eyes adjusted for a little while. Okay, now we're, you're saying now, uh, okay, all that stuff is on the moon. Uh, um, you know, I thought there was one-sixth gravity and I thought there was no atmosphere and, um, you know, how could anybody live up there if there's no atmosphere? Well, I like to straighten out the, uh, the gravity situation first. Is the gravity on the moon is about 64% that of Earth. All that stuff you saw um, on Apollo 11 and all that film was all fake. And uh, that's why the people, the people who don't believe we went there, uh, say all that's fake. Yeah, that was fake. But it was fake for a reason. We did go there. But it's what we found out there that we're keeping a secret. And the, the main things we, you know, we found is that the gravity is 64%, that there is an atmosphere, the sky is not black, the sky is yellow, and uh, there's people that live there. <clears throat> so.